Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I want to share with you this beautiful 3D leaves uh, beret. I love it very much. You can see its backside. I finished with reverse single crochet. I think it's so romantic and so beautiful. It's not so tough, uh, but uh, you need a little uh, careful. But I think it's so fast crocheting. I use one and a half uh, ball of yarn, 100 grams is 210 meters, and uh, I use 4.5 millimeter hook. Uh, you can adapt this beret uh, for everyone. Uh, you can change your hook and yarn. Maybe you can use more thinner yarn than mine. You can do that in same size and uh, it's uh, adjustable for uh, 10 years, 10 to 14, uh, 10 to 12 years. Okay, maybe you will use more thinner yarn again, but you want to make it a toddler, so you can make, not, I give all the details in the video, I start with six groups, so six leaves. Uh, maybe you can make five leaves for toddlers. You can adapt it easily. It's so simple, only increase your leaves after finish and Degreasing, it's so simple. Uh, if you have any questions, please leave me comments and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your time and support. If you're ready, we can start to crochet our beautiful 3D leaf bed. Let's start crochet. I use in my Benny 100% of acrylic yarn. Uh, it's not has any information, only they recommend us using 4 mm hook, but I want to use 4.5 mm hook here. And I think uh, its size is 3, but uh, its uh, one ball is 100 grams and it's equal to 210 meters. First of all, we will start our Benny with magic ring. like that. Grab my yarn. One, two, three chains. Count as my first double crochet. Yarn over, insert into the same space and make here one more double. Chain one, yarn over, make two more double crochet. Chain one, make one more. Two double crochet, chain one. I have three groups. This is the fourth group. Pull through two, pull through two. Yarn over, make one more. Pull through two, pull through two. This is one, two, three, four. Chain one, five. Chain one and six. I have um, six groups of two double crochet. Between of them chain one. Chain one, pull that yarn tightly and close this hole. Insert into the top of my first chain three. Take these two yarns together and close this hole. Lock this hole, actually. Make one more slip stitch and come to chain one space one two three chains and count as first my double crochet at chain one four space so i have here totally four chains make into the same chain one space one more double crochet yarn over insert my hook back to front then back next stitch grab my yarn pull through to pull through to make back post double yarn over insert the next one you know we have two double we crochet this two double two back post when i come to chain one space make double chain one and make one more double when i come to double crochet i crochet it i insert my hook like that back post
when I come to chain one space make here double crochet chain one and double crochet two back post when you come to chain one space double chain one double I complete and turn to you I finished the second round with back post you know we made here chain four insert into the third one join with a slip stitch now we will start to make our leaves and we will increase this V stitch we prepare our leaves on this V stitch and we keep this two back post always same only we make increases on this V stitch like that chain one and not count yarn over insert into the first one as front post grab my yarn pull through to pull through to yarn over I come to chain one space make here V and make your increase double crochet chain one double crochet this is my second double insert my hook like that front to back down front under that double crochet and make here front post double crochet so we increase this two double four double here two of them front post we have here two back post we crochet two back post I come to next V make front post I come to chain one space make double chain one and make double in chain one space and crochet the previous rows double as front post I come to here crochet two back post next one front post come to chain one space double chain one double make one more front post come here crochet two back post complete the third round like that I complete and turn to you finish the third round with two back post again I insert my hook top of that front post not count that chain one okay here join with a slip stitch again chain one and not count yarn over I have here front post crochet front post previous rows double crochet I crochet it as back post uh, sorry next stitch is the double crochet I crochet it as front post again now I come to chain one space I will make here increase double chain one and double you have two stitch you will crochet these two as front post so this leaf increase four to six now you have two back post crochet as back post again come here here two stitch one is front post one is usual you will crochet two of them front post when you come to chain one space double chain one double again you have two stitch you will crochet as front post you have two back post crochet as same as keep these two back post same two front post when you come to chain one space double chain one double two front post two back post I complete this fourth round after turn to you I complete fourth round with back post come to first front post stop and join with a slip stitch chain one and not count make here front post one next stitch front post two yarn over next stitch front post three I come to chain one space I will increase double chain one and double again crochet three front post double crochet 
one, two, three. Now I increase six to eight. I have two back post. I crochet as back post. Okay. Then crochet three front post. You will come chain one space. Make your double chain one double and crochet three front post then crochet two back post you will keep repeat as same as until you uh, your diameter is uh, 23 centimeter it's for an adult size i will keep increasing my leaf as same as i crochet a front post until come to chain one space then i come to chain one space i make here double chain one double then keep the same crochet the all other stitches with front post keep two back post always same not make any increase here only make your increase on your leaves until come to chain one space you crochet front post after chain one space you crochet front post only make your increase in chain one space double chain one double I will crochet like that and make it bigger and make its diameter is 23 centimeter after I will tell you how many rounds I crocheted and uh, how much stitches I increased I will tell you I complete after turn to you I increase it um, until 23 centimeter I will show you here I put from here to here 23 nearly also 24 and it's equal to 9 inches and my uh, front posts you can see that 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 front post and make last V totally 10 stitch here now we start to decrease our leaf and open this back post and make here bigger and bigger I will show you Chain one again and not count. Yarn over, insert into the first one. As front post, grab my yarn, pull through two. I have two loops. Yarn over, insert into the second one. As front post, grab my yarn, pull through two. I have three loops, pull through all together. I crochet first two stitch together. Then, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight front post. Not make any increase in chain one space. Okay, yarn over and keep crocheting as same as until you left here two front post. I crochet as front post. Not make any increase in chain one space. I crochet as same as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 front post. I have here 2 uh, front post left. I crochet 2 together. Insert the first one, grab my yarn, pull through 2. Yarn over, insert the next one, grab my yarn, pull through 2. I have 3 loops, pull through all together. This time we will make increases from here. Yarn over, insert this space and make usual double crochet then crochet two back post yarn over and insert your hook from uh, between of this back post and front post here and make one more usual double crochet so you will increase here two to four then start a new leaf again Insert into the first one, grab my yarn, pull through two. Yarn over, insert into the second one, grab my yarn, pull through two. I have three loops, pull through all together. Then crochet as front post, as same as.
then not make any increase in chain one space and keep crochet your front posts you will left two stitch at the end of this side you crochet your front posts left here two I crochet together insert the first one pull through two yarn over insert the second one pull through two I have three loops pull through all together then yarn over insert your hook between front and the back post here and make usual double yarn over two back post yarn over insert your hook this back post and front post here crochet usual double crochet crochet first stitch together first two stitch and the last two stitch all the others front post double crochet then when you come here make from here one usual two back post crochet here one usual you will complete this round like that after I will turn to you I come at the end of this round you can see I have two back posts now I increase it I insert between this front and the back make usual double then make here two back post one and two then make one more one usual between this back and the front so you increase two to four this time come and insert the top of this two crochet stitch here join with a slip stitch chain one and not count in yarn over insert your hook from here <coughs> we crochet two stitch together you remember previous row grab your yarn pull through two yarn over insert the second one grab your yarn I have three loops pull through all together again we crochet together and degrees one stitch here then I will crochet all of them with front post until left here two stitch this is one this is two I will crochet this together I crochet as front post not make any increase now on the leaf crochet all of them look at here I come here I crochet two stitch together and this is one this is the two inserting to do before of the last stitch grab your yarn pull through two yarn over insert the last stitch grab your yarn pull through two I have three loops pull through all together I degrees two stitch in this leaf then I come here yarn over I insert my hook between front post and the usual double here and make usual double I have four stitch here you can see that I crochet this for as back post insert my hook back to front then back grab my yarn one two three and four now I make here increase yarn over insert my hook from this back and the front here and make one more usual so I increase here four to six then crochet two stitch together make back post until come to last two stitch crochet together when you come here you will make here one usual four back post and the last here between of this make one more usual so you increase four to six next round six to eight you will decrease from the leaf two stitch you will add here two stitch okay you will keep crochet like that I will uh, decrease my leaf and increase my back post part when I uh, finish my leaf until I have two stitch I will turn to you and I will show you how you can finish your bed I complete after turn to you I close the leaf you can see that we have one front post I crochet last two stitch together and I have here 20 back post join two sides together with 
slip stitch. After that, always we will crochet back post and not make any increases. Chain one, yarn over, not count that. Insert my hook back to front, then back. This is my first stitch. This is front post, and I crochet it as back post. Then all the stitches crochet back post. Look at that, come to end, not make any increases. This is front post stitch, I crocheted it as back post. And keep crocheting back post. All the stitches I crochet back post, when I finish the round, come here, join with a slip stitch and crochet back post on back post, not make any increase. I will crochet totally five rounds more I think uh, maybe more I will tell you always crochet back post uh, in every each stitch I complete my rounds after turn to you I crochet five rounds with only back post you can see here and I want to measure it for you you can see from the top to end it's 20 centimeter and it's equal to nearly 8 inches. Okay, now we start to decrease our uh, beret and finish it in 2 or 3 rounds. I don't know how many rounds we will crochet. But now we crochet one usual stitch, one uh, decreasing stitch. I made here uh, like that, I want to show you. I insert my hook back front then back then take this loop to the back side like that after that make chain three okay don't forget that count as my first stitch after I crochet front post but degrees two stitch together insert the next one as front post grab my yarn pull through to yarn over insert the next one grab my yarn pull through to I have three loops pull through all together yarn over crochet one back post next stitch crochet front post insert the next one grab my yarn pull through to yarn over insert the next one grab my yarn pull through to I have three loops pull through all together so one back post one front post but front post I degrees I crochet two stitch together again I will show you one back post double crochet one front post like that pull through two next one pull through two I have three loops pull through all together back post one and two pull through all together I will crochet one back post, crochet two stitch together and crochet front post. I complete after turn to you. I complete the round, come to the first chain three stop and join with a slip stitch. Lose my loop, insert back to front then back, then take my loop to the back side. One, two, three chains, count as my first back post then one back post one front post I will crochet like that one back post one front post I complete this round after turn to you I finish this round come to first stitch stop join with a slip stitch 
Now we finish our uh, beret like that, chain one and notch count, insert into the same and make single crochet. We will, we will make here one more decreasing, insert into the next grab my yarn and insert into the next grab my yarn. I have three loops pull through all together. Next one, usual single crochet. Next two decreasing crochet together. Next one, usual. Next one, grab your yarn. Next one, grab your yarn. Pull through all together. Okay usual now decreasing one next one complete i will turn all around like that after turn two i come to the end join with a slip stitch again we complete and last round i want to make reverse single crochet chain one and not count and insert my hook not this stitch insert here grab my yarn and make single crochet then next stitch grab my yarn and make single next stitch grab my yarn and make single I will show you more slowly insert the back stitch grab my yarn and make single crochet this is looking like that Turn all around like that. This is our last round. After we will finish our bed. I complete and turn to you. I complete the round. Now I turn my work. Insert here and join with a slip stitch. Chain one. Look at that. I think it's beautiful. Not it. And cut my yarn. Hide my tail. I will hide it after you can see that. That's the back side and that's the front side. It's beautiful. I hope you like it. Uh, I use nearly one and a half. Uh, ball of yarn nearly 150 grams i hope you like it and you will try that if you want to make it more bigger or more smaller uh, you can change your yarn or hook uh, maybe you will start if you want to make it for baby you will use more thinner yarn than me and you will make your not six leaf on the top you can make five leaves okay uh, we start with uh, six group you can start with five group or you will use thinner yarn uh, but you will make more leaves okay not six maybe you will make eight this time you can adapt that or you can use like me 100 grams is equal to 210 meters so you can do that uh, in same way like me uh, I use 4.5 millimeter hook you know if you have any questions, please leave me comments and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can reach me on Instagram, on Facebook, on Pinterest and on Etsy as the same name Crochet with Gigi. Hope to see you in new videos. Have a nice day. Bye bye.